I wonder what Mario is doing right now. I wonder if he's hurt. I'm so worried about him. He'll be all right, princess. Why, well, I bet he's saving some star spirits right now. Yes, you're right, Twink. I must be strong. I need to concentrate on finding a way out of here. But there are tons of guards beyond your door, and it's impossible for you to escape through the window. Oh, wait a minute. I remember the minister telling me that there's a secret passage out of this room. Twink, help me look for it. Cool, great idea. Anyways, so we could look here and it's, oh, a photo of Mario. Don't look at that. And there's so many dresses and yet they all look exactly the same. They're not the same. The designs are all slightly different and very fashionable. And if we look here, we can just adjust our makeup. And if we look here, this is no time to sleep. Yes, let's keep looking. However, there's one place we have yet to look. It's behind this photo. Oh look, there's something behind this drawing. And this is the very first of the peach interludes. Yes, cool, now we can get out of this room. Anyway, so I should get the introduction away. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to some more Paper Mario. In the last part, we beat the Koopa Brothers and beat Koopa Brothers Fortress. We got done with chapter one. This part, we're going to do the Peach Interlude. There's going to be Peach Interludes in between each chapter. It's become a, it's, it's a staple in the first few Paper Mario games. At least the first two. Where are we? Anyway, so if we try um, going over here, it looks like it's locked. Oh no, we can't get out. If we go over here. Hey, look at this. It looks like somebody left a private diary that's lying around. Should we read it? Read. Oh, you look, you like doing this sort of thing, do you? Okay then, very quietly. Let's see. Day zero zero month star sunny. Today I went to Star Haven and sold a star run. I'm invincible. Cool. I also captured seven star spirits, so they won't annoy me anymore. It was a hard day's work, and I'm feeling pretty bushed. It was nice, but a bit bland. I feel like I might know the person who wrote this. Should we read more? Okay, let's continue. Day 0-X, month star, cloudy than sunny. Today was great, diary. I used my castle to Princess Peach's grass away up in the sky. Then I barged into Princess Peach's castle and beat up Mario. Yeah, I believe one. Oh, so fun. And then there's more. After that, I kidnapped Princess Peach. I couldn't be happier, Diarrhea. I hope she likes me. Princess Peach, this is Bowser's diary. Ugh. What should we do? Should we read more? Day XX, month star, sunny. Well, the Cooper Brothers got beaten by Mario Diary. He even set free the stupid star spirit I kept there. I'm so mad I can barely write. Oh, I'm Mario. I'm so big and strong and good and helpful. I hate him, but I'm not worried. There's no way Mario can save the star spirit being held in dry, dry ruins. To do that, he'd have to solve the mystery of the sands and then dry, find dry, dry desert ruins in dry, dry desert. How would he even know to go to the desert anyway? So I'm not worried at all. In fact, I'm so calm I'm going to go to bed now. Dry Dry Ruins in the middle of Dry Dry Desert. One of the real stars is being held there. Twink, do you think you can find Mario and tell him that? Yes, of course, Princess Peach. I'll find Mario right away and... Oh no, I can't believe I left my secret diary lying out. It would be so embarrassing if somebody read that thing. What? What? What's the princess doing here? Ah! You little sneak! You read my diary! King Bowser, is there a problem? You're the worst guards ever! Take Princess Peach back to her room! Immediately! Yes, sir. Straight away. Forgive us, sir. <laughs> no! Put me down! Mario, I believe you'll save us all. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate all you've done. Thank you. Since you have freed more from me from my prison, I seal, my, the seal of my power is broken. I will recover it little by little. As long as you know out some power remains in me, I shall help you.
Mario can now use the star be spirit's power in battle. Using a star power means star it requires star energy. Would you like me to listen while I tell you how to use star powers and star energy? Yes. Allow me to explain. Now, Mario, this is your gauge for the star energy. See, you can check to see how much star energy you have. See, there's a star on the right side of the gauge. Each star makes one unit of star energy. So you have one unit now. Next, allow me to explain about star powers. First, let me tell you about refresh, all right? The power enables, this power enables you to restore five hit points of both HP and FP at once. Why not try to refresh right now? See, both HP and FP will cover five points each. Use one unit of star energy and you're empty now. Watch your star energy guys and carefully earn battle. Usually your partner's turn will come next, and it would be your enemy's turn. But we're just practicing now, so assume it's Mario's turn again. Okay, it's Mario's turn. Now pay attention to the star energy, guys. Did you notice that amount of star energy increase a little bit? Star energy increases little by little each time it comes around to Mario's turn. Remember this because it'll become very important. Next, I'm going to teach you about the star, another star power, Focus. Focus is a star power that enables you to increase star energy a little more than usual during a turn. Right now, your star energy is almost empty, even though you're slowly refilling it. Alright, try the star power, Focus, now. Did you, not know, did you notice how much the star energy increased? Focus helped to increase your star energy much more quickly. You should also remember that you can replenish your star energy by taking a nap at a toad house. Well, that wraps up my explanation. I earnestly wish that you'll make good use of these star powers during battle. Mario, listen carefully. You must save the other star spirits quickly. If the seven of us come together, we'll be able to bestow you upon a star power with a star beam. The star beam is the only thing that can counteract the star rod that Bowser wields. I have to go back now, back to Star Haven. I must leave immediately, but I'll always be watching you. Save us all, Mario. Anyway, so now we are going to um, basically gonna go back to Toad Town. And so if we see the, uh, we can now basically see in this menu right here the Star Spirit we, we've saved and what we have yet to save. So it basically gives us a bit of a guide on what to do. So um. I guess there's one thing I'd like to take care of in uh, Koopa Village. I'm not sure if I should cut to it or if I should like go through it normally. I don't know. It's like, uh, let me check my badges really quick. Uh, uh, I don't think I need Smash Charge anymore. Let's, let's play Smash Charge with a uh, close call. So yeah, and uh, I only want, really want to use Smash Charge. Actually, I take that back. Let's put back Smash Charge. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that either. Let's get Smash Charge. Anyway, so yeah, well, uh, we. I also switched out party members. So uh, yeah, we're going to uh, switch back to Bomb So uh, I hope I don't get any more battles. So um, yes, yeah, so we just need to. Uh, I want to take care of something in Koopa Village really quick. You might be wondering why I'm going to Koopa Village. Now, at the start of every chapter, uh, Koopa Koot is going to add some more favors of us. So I thought we'd uh, get them out of the way. So we're, we'll just be, we're just at Koopa Village. We're talking to these guys. I decided to stay here with my friends for a while. It's a nice place. Well, Matt, you're safe. Oh, Joy, I was so worried about you. Mario rescued me. I figured the least I could do was help me the battle of the Kings of the Koopas. Good luck, Bomb Matt. We bomb bombs. We all wishing you luck. Bombs away. We're talking to the Koopas. I always remember Koopa used to always talk about traveling the world as an explorer. Going more is a great chance to travel, isn't it? Makes us proud, Cooper. Well, I guess we can, uh. We 
good. Did I get that uh, story over here? Okay, uh, I did. So let's just tackle. Let's just see what uh, good old Koopa Cute has us to do. Oh, well, look, more. Give it the bird thing. Can you do another favor? Yes. Oh, how very kind of you. I guess the young race are so bad for all. Well then, young fella, I don't use us for favors, but I don't suppose you can go to Goomba Village and find Goompa, the grandfather. He still has a tape I lent him a while back. Can you get it for me? I really want it. If you say the tape, he'll know what you're talking about. Try to keep this whole thing under wraps, would you? So yeah, we have to go back to Goomba Village to fulfill his uh, request. So I guess I w we can do, I guess I got that taken care of. So I guess we can leave Cooper Village for now. I do want to get my FP healed up though. So we're just gonna do that quickly. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so we're just gonna go, we're just gonna go back to Toad Town, because there's nothing else we can do. We're gonna have to go back to Cooper Cute, though. Let's just say this video is gonna be more about the build up to Chapter 2, because, um, let's just say, uh, if you're doing 100% between each chapter, it's best to get out as many side quests as you can at this point in the game. So, yeah, this part's gonna be essentially be side quest oriented. Anyway, so if we uh, go over here a little bit. Hold it right there, Mario. I've been waiting for you. I told you every act, now I'll get my revenge. Here it comes, baby. Check this out. Ah, duh. Mario, I'm talking to you. I promise you, this fight will be much different from before. Who's this kid? Let me get this straight. He wants to challenge you? He's gotta be kidding. Shut up! You, Mario, of course you remember me. Uh, no. It's funny you're saying no. What? Darn it. You don't remember me? Listen, you big lug. My name is Junior Trevor. Remember that and tremble. As this being, you'll definitely remember it. Alright, so, um, get ready to hurt, Mario. I'm gonna show you a new skill he's picked up. Yeah, check that out. You've never seen anything like it before, have you? Your attacks are useless now. Oh, we'll see about that. We're going to force this fight a little differently. We're just going to use Hammer Charge. Because, um, it does use less FP than Power Jump. Yeah, we're just going to charge up our Hammer a bit. Like the Koopa Brothers, Junior Troopa is going to have one, is going to have one bit of defense. So, one point of defense. So, uh, yeah, it's best to get our, so we're now have five attacks with our Hammer. So, um... We're just gonna keep charging our hammer essentially till we run out of FP. Alrighty, so we'll charge it one more time. Yeah, let's see what we can do with the hammer. And I think one more bomb will take it out too. I don't think I've ever done this fight this way. Seven damage. Wow, we took him out. I've never done the fight this. I've never done this fight this way. But uh, yeah, we'll we'll do that. And we, and we'll look at ah ah <laughs> ah. We just blew him up, and he said ah. What if we use Cooper? Ah. Alrighty. <laughs> All right. So now we're back at Toad Town. Mario! Mario, Mario, it's me, Twink, remember me? I heard you saved the Honorable Stars, but it was captured by the Koopa Brothers. Bowser and his gang have, are so angry about it. I knew you could do it, Mario. You're on your way. But enough celebration for now. I come be important information for you. It seems one of the Star Spirits being held captive somewhere in Dry Dry Desert. Bowser wrote it in his diaries, a place called Dry Dry Ruins. The princess braved the dangers of the castle to get you this clue, Mario. If we find out anything else, I'll hurry back to tell you. I have to go back to our highness now. She's so brave. I hope this news helps. Anyway, so I'm going to take a quick nap in the toad house so I can get my FP healed up. Because there's going to be a couple of fights we're going to do in this point in the game. Anyway, so I guess one, th 
I guess one thing we can take care of right off the bat is, um... This. Hey, mister. My dad's opened his shop. Do you want to take a look? It's really cool. It's a bad shop for badges. Come on, check it out. I have lots of rare badges. We're taking a very close look. Now, the first badge I recommend buying right off the bat is the Speedy Spin Badge. Aha, uh -huh, I know Mario. I know you had a key axe badge. That's a good one. You need 50 coins for Speedy Spin. The BP you normally use is one. Do you really like to buy it? Yes. This is the first badge I recommend getting. This is the uh, Speedy Spin Badge. And I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I, I'll get rid of Power Jump. I'll get rid of Refund and place a Speedy Spin. So, um, yeah. When you get this, when you do a spin attack, this basically does twice the, uh, you can basically go twice the distance. Now, um, there's going to be a second, there's going to be a, the next area. There's going to be the next area I'm going to do, the next area of downstairs. So I'm going to tap. I'm going to take a few, I take out, take back out a few items I put in the item shop. We're going to claim a few items. This is how you get the one, the items you check. So I'm going to claim the Goom Nut. And I'm going to claim the Koopa Leaf. And now, uh, let's check our items. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna buy a Fire Flower. I think that should be good. So, I think what we're gonna do now is we're going to go south. We're gonna go south, so, except at first I wanna go to the post office. I forgot to take away, I forgot to take care of that. And they have some, we have a letter for Cooper. It's from Colorado's wife. Cooper, how are you doing? Your mother dropped by for a visit the other day. We, were at, we had a really nice talk over some Koopa tea. She did seem attached to the point that you were still on the road. She said that she's going to cook a delicious dinner for when you come back, so you have something to look forward to. Oh yes, if you happen to see my wayward husband, please tell him to come home more often. Take care, Colorado's wife. And we don't have any more letters, so yeah. We'll switch to bomb at. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is, um. We're gonna actually go and um, go over here. If we go to this house right here. Remember Taste Tea from the beginning of the game? Yeah, she is one of the few people that made it out of Bowser's ca Peach's Castle before it went in the sky, so this also serves the purpose of 100%. Oh my goodness, it's Mario. My name is Taste Tea. I love to cook. If you're very angry at us, we have to fix one of my energy energy giving dishes. Would you want me to cookie something? Yes. We're gonna use the first we're gonna use the mushroom. I should have mushroom, yes. The first thing we're gonna use is the mushroom. Here are the rest is not too bad. Here's in place. We got a fried shrum. Yes. So part of 100 percent is getting all these tasty recipes and there are 50 in the game. So we're also gonna use the honey syrup. We're also gonna use the honey syrup, and the honey syrup will get us. Honey syrup will get us a super soda. And on top of that, we're gonna use the goom nut. Yeah, the rest of it's not too bad, too, please. And we get a nutty cake. And, um. And finally, we're going to use, we're going to use the Koopa Leaf. There's, there's, there's only a couple more left we have to get, and we can get in this area. And we got the Koopa Tea, which restores 7 XP. Anyway, so, um, now, finally, we're going to use the Fire Flower. all we can do for now. Now, um, I'll show you a way, you can, I'll show you one of the ways you can get coins also, because we're, we are going to go back to the item shop, so, um, one of the, another one of the best ways that you can get coins is, um, I did not mean to talk to this NPC, but, uh, another one of the best ways you can get coins is, um, you can sell tasty recipes. We're going to sell the spicy soup, because we don't need that. We're gonna sell the super soda because we don't need that. And we're gonna sell the uh, fried shrimp because we don't need that. However, we're gonna put some more stuff in the, uh, we're gonna check, um, we're gonna check the uh, Koopa Leaf and the Koopa Tea because we're gonna need those a little bit later. 
So yeah, um, there's one last thing I want to do in Toad Town. There's one more thing I want to do in Toad Town. So um, I guess this is a, maybe this might be more a few parts of uh, what we can do in between chapters. Yeah, hey, Mario. I figure I'll give it. I'll get have an adventure sooner or later, so I'm training. What's that, Dry Dry Desert? Oh, sure, there's a train that goes there from Toad Town. Yeah, maybe I'll tag along. No, you sure? Just give me a chance. Anyway, so if we check Mario's chalkboard, we have 12 badges out of 80. We have nine star pieces out of 160. We have five KC recipes out of 50, and we have one Chuck Quizmo quiz. So we're a little far from 100%, but if we check Mario's inbox, we have one from Little T. Hey, hey, dear Mario, how do you do? I, I'm Little T, I'm just a little toad. I live in Toad Town. I've been trained at the dojo so I can save Princess Peach. I'll write to you again later. Bye. And we have one from Vanity. Uh, hello, Mario. I'm Vanity. Chuck Christmas all day this then. Thank you for participating in our quiz show. Our ratings are through the roof. Are the Starpiece helping you? Please keep coming back until we, we ask the last question. I'll cheer you on, Vanity. We have one from the Cooper Brothers. You rat, Mario! How dare you embarrass us! And that video we did red. Hey, watch your back when you walk at night. Black. I'm gonna make you cry, green. You'd better sleep with one eye open, pal. Yellow. We shall return, Cooper Brothers. Yeah, that's all we have for now. So I think I'm gonna cut it off for this part of Paper Mario. So next time on Paper Mario, we're gonna take out, we're gonna tackle the remaining side quests we can do. See you guys then.